hello everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's tutorial today we are going to make a quick video on how to make this amazing login form with rounded corners and input fields email and password and interactivity option with remember me and forget password and login button and don't have account register so let's jump into vs code and together build this page with html and css here in my html i have already set title some script for um, icons and link the style and here i have cover and uh, javascript and style let's start by creating our main content that we are going to hold our form and create a section and for the section here i want to have array labeled by login form And in the section, I want uh, a form and call it a form container. In our form, we want title for login to create a form for the action cell is hash uh, array label here as well. For array label to be login form and this area level provide accessible name for form helping you know users to understand the purpose of the form start by creating our heading and it is h2 with id login form name it login now let's create a class and name it input field for the input here we want first for for email type email and to have name email as well and to have id email as well make it required when we try to submit without filling to give us alert that you need to fill the information and this to have a label for email and name it email the same way let's create another class for input but for password here input type password ID call it password as well and name password make it required label for password now we need to create a class for forget password and here we need input type checkbox and ID to have remember me and label label for remember me and here we need to have a link for forget password write hash and it will be array labeled by forget password and last but not least let's create the button here and this type submit now create a class for sign up button and name it register let's add paragraph let's say don't have account followed by link and this is array labeled labeled by a new account now that's all we need let's go to our CSS file in order to you know design our, our page in our style here let's start by importing our uh, Google font and let's start by creating root CSS variable for easy C management a uh, root and main background color let's say bg to have white and text color to be white as well account color to be white as well and add font family to have a popping And sorry start by universal base style a margin 
to make a zero remove the default from all element padding to be zero as well box sizing it is to include padding and border in element of total width at border box and font font family to have a var and it is and family choose from uh, root variable for the section here uh, display flex enable flexible layout and justify content center content horizontally and align item to center vertically mean height minimum height of viewport say 100 viewport here width to be 100 percent come back later to add background image and here we can just make a comment a class called form container say display flex and justify content to be center say width to be 400 pixel max width 90 percent and height to be 450 pixel padding 20 pixel and background to be transparent add border here 2 pixel solid and color to have make rounded corner border adjust to be 20 pixel to make semi transparent black background RGBA to have 0, 0, 0, 0 0.5 and make blur effect on the background say back drop filter and here is a specify blur blur to have 50 pixel now for a heading here we call it h2 and for the heading let's say font size to be 3m color you know we choose our from our default bar and text align to be center margin bottom to be 30 pixel we have input field and for the input field say position to be relative margin 30 pixel from top and bottom and zero from left and right width to make it 310 pixel make border bottom 2 pixel solid var to have main text color now we have input field label we have position absolute top say 50 percent left to have 10 pixel say transform and this to translate you know offset by half it height to truly center to translate y x to have minus 50 percent transition to have 0 0.5 second font size to have 1.2 m color to have say bar main text color now for input field uh, input so with 100 percent height to have 50 pixel background to be transparent and no border and no outline as well padding left to be 10 pixel color to have var and it is main text color add transition to this as well for the border here 0.4 second for forget class I forget and register text align center color to have main text color and for the links here let's add the link here and link here color to be you know the main text color remove the underline from the links decoration none a bit bolder so say font weight make it 600 margin to have 10 pixel from top and bottom and 20 pixel from left and right to make a space between the links now let's add hover for register and um, 
uh, here I just want to text decoration to have underline for the button width to be 90% and height to be 30 pixel margin to be 16 pixel border radius to have 25 pixel background to have a current color uh, border none and cursor to be pointer font weight to be 800 make a transition for background background color to be 0 0.3 second ease power effect for uh, button here make background color to be lighten to have a count color 20% for text color main text color now to include the icons here email icon and lock icon we need to have this is open source you can go to usage and copy this link and paste it on the head section and go to the icon here and write email and copy this right click you copy it and paste it here and as well we need a lock here and we want this one and copy it and paste it here now if we go back for input field here input field and it is ion icon and for this let's say position salute right to move to right side so let's say 10 pixel top to have 15 pixel uh, let's add the color main text color and let's say var is variable main text color now remain the last you know here we have on the section we have a background and for the background we need to have url and we have image as cover so let's say cover to not repeat it and background position and background size to be cover everything is okay now one last thing is when we want to write our email here as you see you know this above label so we need to make this to move forward let's target input and for that let's say focus label and the second one is input valid uh, label top uh, minus six pixel now that's all for today thank you very much for tuning in if you like this tutorial give it a thumb up and if you want to see more content like this don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell to get notified until next happy coding